NASA mission experts have unveiled a stunning new image of a huge star on the cusp of exploding, taken by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. Premiered during a keynote called, Unfold the Universe, broadcast live on YouTube from Austin, Texas, the image shows a wolf ray star called WR-124 about 15,000 light-years distant. That means the light from that star has been traveling through space for about 15,000 years until it hit the detectors in JWST's near-infrared camera, NIR cam. Wolf ray stars are among the most massive stars that have been found in the Milky Way only 500 times. They are thought to exist for only a few million years, a mere moment in cosmic time, and are thought to explode violently at the end of their lives in a supernova explosion. The image shows a halo of cosmic gas and dust around the star, which JWST is able to capture because of its sensitivity to infrared light. That halo comprises the heavy element building blocks of the modern universe, including life on Earth. What we're seeing in this beautiful new image at the very center is a star. At the end of a star's life, it sheds its outer layers out into the rest of the universe. That dust is spreading out into the cosmos, and will eventually create planets and this is how we got here. The star in the image is about 30 times the mass of our sun, so lives fast and dies young. A partnership between NASA, the European Space Agency, and the Canadian Space Agency, JWST is a $10 billion space telescope that sees in the infrared part of the spectrum. That means it can see through dust and gas, which visible light can't penetrate. The primary mirror of JWST is composed of 18 hexagonal segments made of beryllium and coated with a super-thin layer of gold, which makes it an ideal material for reflecting infrared light. That's six times more light-collecting power than the Hubble Space Telescope. To detect infrared light successfully, JWST has to remain insanely cold. Made of Kapton, its five-layer sunshield is as large as a tennis court and functions like a parasol by dividing the observatory into a warm side with temperatures around 230 of facing the sun, and a cold side, with temperatures around minus 385 degrees Fahrenheit to 233 degrees Celsius. The layers are separated by a vacuum, which serves as an insulator. It was launched on Christmas Day in 2021 and has since February 2022 been orbiting the L2 point, which is about a million miles, 1.6 million kilometers from Earth, four times the distance of the Earth to the Moon, on the opposite side to the Sun. It revealed its first images on July 12, 2022. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more content like this. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an upload. We would also love to hear your thoughts and feedback, so please leave a comment below and let us know what you think. Thank you again for your support, and we'll see you in the next video.